In this tutorial series, we'll build this skilling system, the SkillTree Pro. It's a AAA skilling system, full featured, highly customizable, scalable, optimized, modular, with all the functionality you might expect from a skilling system, and a bunch of other really useful bonus stuff. It's on the Epic Games Marketplace at the link in the description if you want to see all the features in detail. A skilling system is something almost all games need. In essence, it's simply a way for progress with persistent changes to be made in your game. So the idea is, if you make a skilling system and you make it right, you can use it in all your future games and never need to design one again. So we will not be cutting corners, we'll put in the work to create something truly nice. The goal of this tutorial series is not only to leave us with an extremely useful asset, but also walk through and learn about intermediate to advanced development techniques. We'll create a highly customizable and performant UI material, create a designer-driven system which allows us to design what the skill tree nodes will look like in various states that automatically animates them for us, write procedurally generated code so we can simply add entries to a data table and play with sliders to determine the look of our skill tree which the system auto creates for us, and many other things such as soft references, enhanced input, proper zooming, autofocus, persistent saving, and more. More generally, you'll walk away with a better understanding of how to design systems to be optimized and scalable, and how to design a game system in a modular way, so you can just add a component to any project and then use it. Due to time constraints, we'll only be developing the single player part of the system in this series. The version on FAB is fully multiplayer, including anti-cheat and cloud state saving. But if you're developing a single player game, this is the perfect series to follow along with. Best of all, no C++ is required. This is done entirely in Blueprint. With that said, let's get started in the next video.